Hi friends, now I am going to show you how to install Python and open CV. By uh, what are the errors across while you are doing first you will give open CV. In that you may found uh, according to your OS just download minus Windows 10. So I am using that uh, Windows 10 link. In that it will mostly the software uh, source for just code it will give good uh, result of downloading the important document file save it will automatically download if you click that button it will download and you have to double click that folder it will extract and you have to put it on c colon administration colon okay here we have to paste i have pasted here you may found build the source if you want to do if you want to know anything you can go in build in that you will find according to your os background it is 32 or uh, uh, 62 64 according to that you may found the programming here now we'll see how to download python um, the best for open and python supporting all the version is 2.0 uh, 7 version you, you may go with that uh, I didn't work with python 3 because of my project so I am going with 2.7 it supports till now in that 2.7 go to the release we'll choose that first link in that link uh, I am having uh, the download for windows uh, python 2.6 and 2.7 you just click that one it will go to download give save okay i have already installed by double clicking it will get install of uh, python uh, idle is uh, graphical user interface you can find python in many platform i'm using shell in windows uh, this is a python folder where i have seen in uh, c colon in that python 2.7 you may find uh, so many in that to install packages newly go to command prompt and i think that you have to give using pip mostly uh, using pip install we can uh, download uh, all our packages usage of packages so pip install a uh, numpy matplotlib and sci uh, si numpy is everything is needed for basic uh, running of python shell for this we have to have already uh, installed so i'm not showing that it will come already satisfied uh, for the new people, you just prefer pip install live uh, with pip install numpy and the thing and pip install cv2, pip install cv3 for each command. Now you have to important thing after installing that, go to this PC, right click that properties. You found this dialog box advanced system settings in that environmental variables. Important thing. No one has uh, mostly didn't shown in their uh, videos what I have while I'm searching. So I use I'll go to the system environmental from this piece that I'm clicking that one. Now you in user variable give my path where the Python have installed just to give that in uh, that column exactly what have sh what have is showing showing in uh, that video just to follow the same in system variable also you have to give by clicking new we have to give important thing is for that one we have for upper one you have to give only the path in uh, downside you have to give in path you may found so many uh, c colon installation for environmental variables in that you have to give c colon python where that file and the python script also the two columns separate separate column you have to give okay this is a very important thing if you couldn't if you didn't uh, do this you may surely get error in while doing the install links command prompt so be careful be alert so do this one okay click okay apply close now it will use ok 
Okay. After this, uh, to working with that Python uh, for your comfortableness, um, go to that C colon where the Python have saved, where the Python folder is. Okay, in that command plot, now uh, I'm showing it already installed. So the syntax is for using is pip install. Okay, what other things for your particular project? Now, a Python shell for Python ideally GUI is I'm using. We have installed. So. Uh, after this go to file after getting this window go to file click new new file first you have save it according to your project name according to your studying video just name it give separate folder where python have installed in that folder itself you create one particular folder for your uh, program to save so efficient way to avoid confusions while uh, working after some days to retrieve the data here you just give for which project you wanna to work okay this is the um, ac method i found while i'm working so i'm saying this okay in that you just save according to your uh, program after that we will do in next video i will show how to load the image save the image and to view the image it's a basic step if you know this then we can get the output okay here the session like if you have been aware of matlab we will have a editor window then command window this is the type of command window for python shell okay the important thing to save the image what are the image you are gonna to access just to put it on the python folder itself where you have installed because it is good to work it will avoid so many errors okay Uh, before uh, working with OpenCV, you have to be aware of whether you have installed CV to the PYD file. Okay, it will be available in OpenCV built in that according to your version Python, uh, Windows 32 or 64, you just copy paste it on this file. I'm just showing what are the folders inside in that folders. These are the folders inside the python where you have installed in uh, c colon okay just to go through once but don't open or don't alter anything okay these are the uh, booting uh, program i can say like in this way to process our video it will uh, these are the ideal java libraries to run this code on windows so these are the things, uh, basic things you should know. The library script or the important things uh, while working you may found very useful uh, in your video before. Okay. Uh, if you start uh, studying Python using Python, you may know this is a picture I have um, I'm using for my project. So I have saved say here for my uh, to avoid many errors. Okay, these are the things you have to know basically. Okay, thank you.